present. So we've looked at a few misheard lyrics before, but today they're gonna get a little weird. For example, take Cannibal by Kesha. I'm just surprised Kesha is a cat nipple. I always took her to be more of a dog nipple. I, am I mean, the original lyrics are cannibal, and that's kind of what I'm hearing. <laughs> okay, I guess I kind of hear it. Kind of sounds like she's saying can can cannonball too. Cannibal. You know, the thing you yell before you jump into a pool. Cannibal. Oh, I almost ruined things. Okay, I'll stop now. All right, so now they're saying she's saying cat nipple, but she says she's saying cannibal. Well, there's only one way to settle this debate. I have a text-to-speech program, and I'm going to use it to see what Kesha is actually saying. We call it the text-to-speech test, or the t -t -t test for short. No, hold on, Kesha, shut the... I don't care what part of the cat you are. This program sucks cat nipples. All right next up, we got the police in their song, Message in a Bottle. Wow, that actually sounded like it. A year has passed since I broke my nose. Oh, and by the way, how did you break your nose, Sting? When you're changing in your room and doing other private things, I'll be watching you. Let's give it the test and see if Sting really did break his nose a year ago. A year has passed since I wrote my note. My notes. Yep, my notes. He did not say my nose. And in fact, when the music is cut out, it sounds like the original lyrics. So Sting did not break his nose. But he's gonna if he keeps spying on me in the shower. All right, next up we get, ah, ah, mm -hmm, ah, ah. Next up we got Elton John with his song, Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds, which is a Beatle cover. A girl with colliders go by. Okay, that was close. That was more like a girl with colitis go by. But that was definitely colitis. A girl with colitis go by. A girl with colitis go by. What the hell? What's the to you, Elton? What does it matter to you if a girl has an inflamed colon? Ugh, there goes a girl with an inflamed colon. Not interested. I'd go out with a girl with an inflamed colon. I don't judge. Elton. Let's use science to see what he's actually saying. All right. A girl with kaleidoscope eyes. A girl with kaleidoscope eyes. Oh my god! She actually has colitis! Looks like Elton John was singing about girl with colitis. Okay, next up we have Mariah Carey with her song, I Stay In Love. What? Okay, what are the actual lyrics? That, that was very clear. It's no wonder Nick Cannon left you. You probably scared him away. Hey Nick, I was thinking we could try something new tonight. Why don't you get the whale costume out of the closet? Okay, here's the actual lyrics. Oh, okay, <laughs> okay. Wow, well, that is much less offensive. Mariah, you had me scared for a moment there, Mariah. What? That's what I'm saying. Don't just sit there like, what? what? You know what? I am this close to busting out the whale costume. What is it about pop music that makes me want to stop listening to pop music and do some nut trimmage? That's right. <laughs> Manscaped are the sponsors for this video. They are the leaders in men's below the belt grooming and 
hygiene, so they have for you the new Lawnmower 4.0. The Lawnmower 4.0 has advanced ceramic blades and advanced skin safe technology. That's gonna give you the trim you want without having to worry about cutting your uh, scrodigular. And it's cordless and waterproof, so you can even shave in the river, no one would even know. What is that guy doing? Oh, he must be shaving with the lawnmower 4.0. Oh, you mean the one with the super cool USB charging dock that Stevie T absolutely loves? Yes. And it has 90 minutes of battery power per charge. And if you press the on and off button three times quick, it enters the travel lock mode, which prevents it from accidentally turning on while in your bag and draining the battery and buzzing awkwardly. I forgot to turn on the travel lock. So to get your own lawnmower 4.0, your lady wants you to, <laughs> follow the link in my description and use my promo code TERRYBERRY to get 20% off your own lawnmower 4.0 with free international shipping. And as always, your balls. Well, thank you. All right, next up we have REM, Losing My Religion. This is a well-known misheard lyric. Ironically, they cut to the fountain when he said that. Um, let's pee in the fountain. Is Are you guys literally hearing let's pee in the corner? That's me in the corner. That was clearly that's me in the corner. As much as I would like for it to be let's pee in the corner, it's just not. And besides, Michael Stipe already peed on his forehead. Check out that piss unibrow he's got. I peed on my forehead. All right, did Michael Stipe pee in the corner? Let's find out. Tits test. That's me in the corner. That's me in the corner. There it is. As I told you guys, you guys are on a little bit of cracky McSalad if you think that's let's pee in the corner. I gotta go take a leak. I'll be right in the corner. Oh, Michael Stipe is really onto something. This is great. All right, next up we have Van Halen. Panama. <laughs> Woo! I agree. Got to get that uh, padded bra for your uh, cat nipples there. <clears throat> but are you guys really hearing padded bra? Okay, I definitely heard padded bra that time. Wow, I'm not gonna be able to unhear that now. Well, that's just great, thanks. Let's do the tits test. Yeah, it has no clue. Maybe that's because this is live and it sounds like Yeah, that sound quality is ass. All right, next up we got Maroon 5 in their song, Sugar. Wow! That was good, actually. Let's listen. I have never heard that sentence said more seductively. I'm soaked in wee. Well, there's a line to try if your uh, significant other tries to leave you. Uh, if you leave, I'm gonna soak myself in my own urine. I don't care. I don't care. Okay, I'll stay. All right, if Adam Levine is without you, is he soaked in wee? There's only one way to find out. You feel his pants if you see him. Let me know. <laughs> then? Then wasn't even in the sentence. <laughs> you know, this thing is getting lazier and lazier. I hear phones like adapt to your personality. But I'm without you, uh, I'm so green. Yeah. Right, next up we got Fallout Boy. Mr. Mother Guy Complex, Cockney Holy. But this song is, this ain't a scene, it's an arms race. I think that's it. Their titles are ridiculous. <laughs> like, what was that? This ain't Sydney, it's a god ass face? This ain't Sydney, it's a like, freaking pronounce your words, bro. Like, you're allowed to close your mouth to enunciate. You're just like, There's no other option. 
caption there. You would never get the actual lyrics from that. I'm a leading man, and the lies I weave are oh so intricate. Mm-mm, bud, no, you're a little man into cats. I'm sticking with that. You'll, you'll be fighting girls off left and right using that as your dating profile. Uh, my name is Steve. I'm a little man. I'm also evil. Um, oh, and I'm really into cats. And cat nipples. <laughs> All right. Tits is test. I'm a leading man. And the lies of evil are so intricate. <laughs> this thing couldn't hear my ass after a Taco Bell buffet. Do you know what time it is? It's time for one minute Miss Heard Lyrics Try Not To Laugh Challenge. And we're going up against the king of Miss Heard Lyrics, Vince Neil of Motley Crue. Motley Crue live, that would piss me off. Ladies and gentlemen, Vince Neil and his acapella rendition of Wonderwall. Today, you, not anybody. Oh my god. What? That was freaking brutal. Did you hear that last note? Ah! <laughs> Those are symptoms of inflamed bowels. Seriously, like he's he was one of the best singers from the 80s. How does this even happen? Here's Vince Neil. Here's keeping up your vocal talents. <laughs> Vince Neil, go pee in the corner and wait for me while I bust out the whale costume. Well, thank you guys so much for joining me today. I love each and every one of you. Jump and feed me as a girl! Play me as a girl. Bye. <laughs>